This is Starwing, or Star Fox, depending on where you come from, on the Nintendo SNES. Uh, this uses a Super FX chip. It was the first game for the SNES to use the Super FX chip, designed by Argonaut, who were responsible for uh, Star Glider 2, which was a great game. Anyway, this isn't a walkthrough, playthrough, review, blah blah blah, it's just me playing the game, so you can see what it looks like. Uh, no doubt playing very badly, because that's usually the case. <coughs> I had this game back in the day, and uh, so I was really into 3D graphics, you know, anything vector graphics, polygons, you name it, I loved it. So, um, I was a big fan of this game. Goodbye. Thank you, I'll need it. <coughs> But I, I really do like Super FX games for the SNES. I mean, without it, it just it couldn't do 3D. So when I saw this, I was way impressed. I haven't played this in the best part of however many years since it was out. So obviously, I will be rubbish. trying to get a different... I know you can get different views and I can't seem to get it. Oopsie. I know there's an internal view. Oops. I'm sure there's an internal view. Oops. Oh crap. Here we go. <clears throat> if I remember rightly, I've got to shoot the flashing bit. Yeah, that. Oops. I won't do it like that.
say about this obviously I'm not talking much in this video because well the game speaks for itself really ah, I knew there was an internal view somewhere help you where are you remember this. Oops. Can't remember what those rings of stars are for. Probably some kind of power up. good this is. Oh. oh my god. Think I'm in trouble. Yeah, there I go. That'll have to do. I'm out of time. Fantastic game. Absolutely love it. Starwing, Star Fox, Nintendo Snares. Classic game. So anyway, this and videos of other games in my collection and a video of my console and computer collection can be found on my YouTube channel along with a link to my website, benwaysworld.co.uk. Thank you for watching. <laughs>